Tell me about the Bremon story. I'd love to know. Well, really, from us, it, it was, you know, we grew up with this amazing father, PhD aeronautical engineer from Cambridge, and it, but he was amazing with his hands and built boats, we lived on old cars and all of that. But one of his big passions is watches and clocks. And uh, so he grew up around watches and clocks and always loved them. And then he, he died in a plane crash in 95, very sadly, with Nick, and Nick amazingly survived. And, and that was our trigger point to go and do something we love. And where do you get your ambition from? What we were very aware of growing up was this amazing history of British watchmaking. And everyone thinks it's all Swiss made. Turn of the century, we're making half a lot of watches. The world sets its time by Greenwich Mean Time. 50% of modern mechanical watch designed by British watchmakers. So we we're really aware of this and, and we had this passion. We thought, actually, we can manufacture this in the UK. And the name Bremont, where did you get the name from? A couple of years after our father died, Giles and I were flying down an, an old 1940s airplane down through France. And uh, we had a precautionary landing. So we landed in this field. So Giles was hitchhiking uh, to try and find some fuel. some fuel. And this farmer came out and said, actually put your airplane in my barn. It reminded us so much of our father. It had sort of old tractors, old clocks, old tools in this workshop. And he had a passion for aviation as well. So we spent three or four days with him and uh, his name was Anton Bremont. So, 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 wow. we, so we left and thought oh, Bremont's a nice sounding name. It, it looked good on a watch and meant something to us. So yeah. So if you look forward over the next 10 years, where will that ambition take you? You know, in 20, 30 years time, if we can look back and say, what was Bremont about? It would be actually we played a role, whether it's big or small, and reinvigorating watchmaking this yeah, country. Yeah, that's key. Well, look, I really appreciate it. I mean, on the basis that time is clearly money. <laughs> it is. And I've taken a lot of your time. It's been wonderful it. to hear about your story and uh, many, many congratulations. And I hope over the next 10 years, the growth will be as good as, if not better than the past 10. But well, it's been great to meet you. Thank you very much for coming along. Well done. Really nice to meet you. Thanks for watching. Thank you.